some girl and blow up. Ready, done. I wear some girl and blow Final question on South Africa. Um, your trip to South Africa, would you say it fractured your relationship with some of your teammates? I know, for instance, Michael Holding was very, very adamant about West Indies players went to South Africa. Um, did it fracture your relationship with him? Not from my point of view. I knew all about him, but not from my point of view, it didn't. I was shocked and surprised with some of the things that he had said. I just couldn't believe some of the things he had said and continue to say it to date. Mm -hmm. Because he was the man who called me when we went to play for Kerry Parker and tell me that it is a secret nobody must know. And I kept the secret and nobody knew. They say some of the same things when they went to Paco. They are mercenaries. They are sellouts. Some of the same argument that was made against us when we played for Kerry Parker, the same argument was made mm -hmm. when we went South to Africa. South Africa. Yes. And a little bit worse. Yes. Yes. I spoke to Michael all day when I was in South Africa and wanted him was to join us. We had need done a fast bowl. And Mike and I were considered to be friends. And he was going through some knee issues. His carry was on the downside. He was prone in Tasmania. And we wanted somebody else. And I called him. I spoke to him. He was going to be offered even more money than I was going to be paid to come down. So I was looking at it from a point of view of, this is my friend, I'm going to call him and let him mm -hmm. have a PD, a final PD as well, because we know that this is, I mean, the game is not here forever. Yes. And you will have to live on. Mm -hmm. And the conversation that he and I had was extremely pleasant. And good. He, he did not, in that conversation, behave as it was. Why are you calling me about this? I have no way I did. That wasn't the conversation. The conversation went, but even if I could come, I am here on a contract. Why are you saying that to me? Mm -hmm. If you come back after the whole thing, come and say the things you say about us. Yes. You, you, you know what I'm saying? He was not. It's no way. Wait, this is not a discussion. No way. Yeah. I would not come here. That wasn't the discussion mm -hmm. we had. Right. You understand? Mm -hmm. And the next day, I think he spoke to somebody. I don't know if it's his parents or whoever he spoke to after he had died. Uh, and they told him not to go. Not to go or whatever it is. And then mm -hmm. from that day, the, the next day, on. Mm -hmm. Ridiculed me in the paper. The man said, to Tell the press that I called him and after him to come to South Africa, which I believe was a low blow on his part. Because even if I had called, I had called him, he should have protected that situation. As a friend, as a, former play, as a player who played with me, and the man who called me when I went to South Africa, when I went to Paco. Yes. And then he should have at least granted me that. We really should have. He should have held his secrecy. He could have said I was offered to go there mm -hmm. and I know where I'm going to take up that contract. He didn't have to mention who called him. Yes, yes. With the gift of hindsight now, and 30 years have passed since the whole South Africa thing, you've mentioned misunderstandings. You've suggested there's been probably some betrayals that went on. You were taken out of context in some newspaper articles. Do you ever look back sometimes in your private time and say, you know what, I know why I went to South Africa. I went there to try to bridge the gap between the races. I went there to be an ambassador and to help out the situation there. But you know what, with all the headaches it has caused me, I probably should have just not gone. Do you ever say that? No. To date, I believe I made the right decision based. To be honest still, I believe this was something, a message I get from the higher powers. To do it. Mm -hmm. Is the honest truth happening? Yes. Okay. No regrets. No regrets. Okay.
Now when some girl them blow up, ready done. I wear some girl them blow.